Mike Gundy and the Cowboys have a lot to be proud of after Saturday's game. OSU demolished TCU. The final score was 63-17. to While the scoring was slow to begin the game, the Cowboy offense took off and outscored the Horned Frogs 21 to nothing in the second quarter. So, I mean, we were good in all three phases tonight. Uh, I mean, I don't really need to get into statistics or all that. I mean, everybody saw it. And so um, I was just proud of our guys. We were able to get a number of young players in the game and they performed well. While the team as a whole was consistent and played one of their best games this year, the run game was the most successful part of the offense. In the first half alone, running back Jalen Warren ran for 103 yards on 14 carries with three touchdowns. By the end of the game, the Cowboys racked up a whopping 724 yards of total offense, with almost 500 of those being from the run game. Well, I think that we can go downhill and, and run the football uh, whenever we want to, essentially, and, and, and be able to rotate guys through uh, being fresh. With OSU being up 43-3 to to start the fourth quarter, some starters were pulled to give other players some playing time. Under center, senior Ethan Bullock came in for a couple of snaps, and freshman Gunnar Gundy ended the game leading the Cowboys. True freshman Blaine Green got his first touchdown of the season. Blaine is twin brother to Bryson, and both of the Green boys are key pieces to the depth of the receiving core. He's very smart, and he has a skill set to, you know, play at the wing position and to go out at slot and then also the skill position to play out wide so he you can really put him everywhere it was a historic game for the cowboys even before the outcome was finalized 1988 heisman trophy winner and osu alum barry sanders was immortalized into the boone pickens stadium ring of honor we always want our cowboys to play their best but it was fitting for the running game to do so well in front of one of the greatest college running backs ever you know barry told me today that he enjoyed that part of it as, as he always does, but it's pretty cool that, you know, I mean, this day was for the greatest college running back ever. I don't think that's even up for debate, and I don't know what we rush for. We OSU is on the road for the final time this regular season. The Cowboys, who are currently ranked 10th in the AP and college football playoff rankings, travel down to Lubbock to take on the Red Raiders of Texas Tech. Tech is 6-4 and four on the season and is coming off of a win over Iowa State. Kickoff is at 7 p.m. on Fox. Tune into the show on Friday for a full preview of that matchup. For The Daily O, I'm Alex Dusky.